Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Ethan Houston. We got sticky free sunshine out there across the Susquehanna Valley. Temperatures rising back up to near average. However, humidity values are typically what we see in late September and early October. So it is refreshing as you step out the door right now. 75 degrees in the Red Rose City with a light breeze on the northwest at 12 miles per hour. But that's the kicker. Dew points down into the 30s. All is quiet on the radar since we have clear skies. I do expect the radar to remain quiet through the night tonight and also for your Saturday. Our weather pattern starts to change as moisture starts moving in first in the form of some clouds from the southwest Sunday morning and eventually will give way to some pop up showers and thunderstorms as we head through Sunday, uh, Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. So sunny and comfy. The winds start dying down as we get closer to sunset. Temperatures will start falling into the 60s and they'll bottom out in the low to mid 50s with clear skies, comfortable low humidity values for tonight and also for your Saturday, but it is going to be a little bit warmer tomorrow. Highs will be in the low to mid 80s with just a few passing clouds as we go through the morning and also the afternoon. So great weather for runners. The Red Rose run kicks off at 8 o'clock. Temperatures will be in the mid 50s and then for the kids fun run back into the mid 60s. Also great weather for the U.S. Women's Open at the Lancaster Country Club. Temperatures will rise into the lower 80s. And I do expect the winds will be relatively light during the afternoon. Gorgeous weather as we go on into the evening. Pollen count not as high as the past couple of days. It's just at a moderate level tomorrow. It's the oak and the grasses that may cause the sniffles. UV index is going to be high. You could burn out there in 30 minutes, but because of that low humidity tomorrow, the air quality is going to remain at good levels. We made it to 75 for our high today. Start of the day off cool, just 51 out at the airport, but we did have some spots in some shelter valleys with lows this morning in the mid to upper 40s. Right now it's 75 if you're joining us from Lebanon, also in Harrisburg and in York and Lancaster. So seasonable out there across the valley, a little bit warmer off to our south and to the west, and that's where we're watching our next storm starting to form back over the mid Mississippi River Valley. But until then, large and in charge, ridge of high pressure basically centered directly overhead, making for a comfortable night tonight. By the time we head into tomorrow afternoon, it's going to start to scoot out to sea. That's going to allow some moisture to move back in first in the form of some clouds, but we're staying dry through tomorrow night also into Sunday morning. It's Sunday afternoon. The shower and thunder shower chances start to rise and we're talking the highest chances as we get closer to Sunday evening. So if you're heading out there to the US Women's Open on Sunday may need to bring the umbrella. I do expect we'll drive back out for your Monday. Isolated showers and thunder shower chances will return going on into Tuesday, but more summer like weather is anticipated as we go through next week with highs in the low to mid 80s with higher humidity values, more cloud cover and nearly daily chances for passing showers and thunder showers. At this time, the highest chances for showers and storms next week will be on Wednesday and Thursday and as we go into the following weekend.